Well, what I have here is a piece of no-name generic brand 1 gig stick of DDR2 RAM. So uh, I guess I'll just put it in this uh, Lenovo because I took a stick out to put in another computer and I'm replacing it. So yeah, it had like two 512 sticks and I combined them or replaced them with a uh, single gig stick and now I'm going to add another single gig stick in here and test it to see if it works. Alright, computer's open, got everything hooked up, so now we'll go ahead and install this stick. Ah, myself situated here. And, uh, yep, it's already got one gig in, so we will add the second gig in the only available slot. Which, I guess, this one can handle up to four gigs of DDR2, but again, the processor limits it to about three. So, alright, we'll go ahead and get this one installed and try it. All right, RAM is in there, perfect fit. So now we will turn the computer on and see if it works. Should get an error message about the RAM difference or change in RAM. There we go, finally starting up. Yep, there we go. The RAM has changed, so yeah, I guess it's going to go ahead and <laughs> reboot. All right, so now we're starting. We'll go ahead and let it boot up and we will check the system. While we wait for it to boot, it is a 3000J series Lenovo tower computer with an AMD processor. Of course, it's got to configure updates. Yes, I know it finished updates, so now that it's finally booted up, it's got a control panel. Span this out and get everything to come up. Man, I thought adding another gig to, of RAM to this computer would speed it up, but, uh, jeez, guess not. There we go, finally. System. Okay, two gigs installed. Excellent. So, we have 1.9 gig processor AMD Athlon 64. Yeah, that processor probably limits it. Uh, system rating not available. Well, let's go ahead and rate the computer, see if it does anything. Alright, accessing memory performance. We're almost done here. Now it's complete. Let's see what we got. Ah, 3.8. With the RAM edition, brings it to a 5.5. Graphics, eh, figures 3.8. It's only a generic graphics card in there. Gaming graphics 5.3. Wow, that's impressive. 5.3 on the hard drive. So, yep, processor 4.5. So, yeah, good enough. That'll work for an office PC. So, good. RAM tests satisfactory. And I can just go ahead and button this thing back up. So, awesome. Well, there you go. Testing a generic brand. This came from China. It only took about two weeks. I was shocked. I thought it would take probably closer to a month. But, uh, nope. Got here pretty quick, so uh, finally getting a chance to install it. And yep, I think I'll leave it uh, in this computer for future use in an office environment. So there you go. Hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, thanks for watching.